Hey y'all, Carpetbagger here, coming to you live from the north, more specifically, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and I'm at Laurel Hill Cemetery, and I'm here because someone, someone very important to me is buried here. Yeah, right here we have the grave of Adrian Balboa, the fictional character from the Rocky movies. Now this fictional character, who's apparently now deceased, has her own grave here in a real cemetery so that if they film Rocky movies, Sylvester Stallone can come out here and stare wistfully at it. So apparently, this graveyard has a reputation as being somewhat unusual and somewhat tongue-in-cheek even. Well, I guess it's a graveyard that doesn't take itself too seriously, as evidenced by the fact that the cemetery has a skeleton on a bicycle right here amongst the graves. Okay, honestly, I have never seen a cemetery with a gift shop before. It's a coffin with a view. You can actually open it up and look at the horrifying face of the dead person down in there. Look at all those Washington monuments back there. Like this. This is so cool. It's the above ground casket with English ivy and an anchor on it. That's beautiful. Okay. What's this? William Hogg. Living down in the ground. I don't think I've ever seen that where there's a staircase down to your actual dead body. Huh. Oh wow. I am unclear on what's going on here. We got a guy with a staff, got a donkey with his ears cut off, and a man sitting on a grave and I I bet there's actually a real body in there. Looks like there's ivy growing out of this crypt. Interesting when you think about what this ivy is living off of inside of the crypt. That, like a giant Y. I like the color of this grave, that dark color. It's an anchor and like a Captain America shield on the bottom. Not even entirely sure what that is. I'm not sure what that grave is supposed to even look like. Robert Ralston Stewart. Just like a pile of rocks or something. Alright, this over here is one of the most amazing monuments I've ever seen. This armless woman here is actually lifting open this casket. Then there's like a ghost or an angel escaping from the casket. That is freaking amazing. I wonder if there's a body in there. So there you have it folks. Laurel Hill 
cemetery. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. If uh, if you'd like to see where I've been in the past, there's an interactive map in the description where you can watch videos of places that I've been and make suggestions on places that I need to go. Also, I sell t-shirts below and I do have a Patreon. Appreciate you guys watching.